you ever want to know what civil unrest is going to look like, this is what it's going to look like. I mean, think about it. I've said this in my other videos. They're dressed like the freaking military. They're not dressed like the police. They are ready for war. This is what a police state looks like. This is what I've been talking about for a very long time. Yeah, and granted, a lot of the protesters, a lot of the rioters have been doing stupid crap they shouldn't be doing. They shouldn't be antagonizing them. In the same token, I've seen them, I've seen the police to shoot tear gas at just nobody. People just standing on the front porch, aren't even in it. They're just standing there watching, getting the tear gas thrown at them. This is what martial law, you saw it in Boston. You see it in Missouri right now. And you, you wonder why our government's buying up all these bullets, buying all these MRAPs. They're being trained to get ready to go to war with the American people, plain and simple. You see this? It's called LRAD. Let me look at this. LRAD's military weapon. Please continue to move to your vehicles or to your homes. Total martial law. All others, we need you to continue peacefully moving. Oh, we got some, uh, felt like some plain close, close police officers. I mean, look at dude with a sniper rifle. And there's your LRAD. And there's your tear gas. I tell you, my other video, I was talking about Greece. It's not as bad like this yet, but uh, boy, it sure resembles Greece when they just went plumb crazy. I mean, look how crazy it's up there. And you know, like him like or not, Ron Paul said that Boston was a front run for what was going on was a front runner for all this. He said it was a front runner for martial law. And once you start it there, it's going to start trickling down everywhere.